How to draw a similar triangle to a given triangle? In this 3D animation video we are going to learn this now. The process of drawing a similar triangle is taught in subject of mathematics of 9th 10th standard students under the curriculums of CBSE and other boards. Board exams award 5 or 6 marks for this drawing. And it is very easy, simple and interesting question. This drawing or construction should be practiced regularly to get the guaranteed marks of 5 or 6. Watch the video till the end. Because at the end of the video, the relative size of those two triangles is shown. Before we get started, let me tell you that this is the only YouTube channel where all geometrical construction, theorems and interpretations related to science and mathematics are shown, using 3D animation. So, in order, not to lose the channel from your phone, subscribe to the channel right now. We will be learning the entire procedure by solving a typical question. Question discussed here is adopted from NCERT's 10th grade math textbook. It is mentioned on page number 220. Exercise 11.1 .1. Question number 3 The statement of the question is like this. Draw a triangle with 5 cm, 6 cm and 7 cm arms. Then draw another triangle, whose corresponding arms are 7 fifths times the arms of the previous triangle. So, let's start the construction. First of all, the line segments with the sizes, mentioned in the question, will be drawn, one by one, to the left of the page. Seven centimeters line segment. Then six centimeters. And at the end, five centimeters. Now, with the scale and pencil, a large line segment of random length is drawn on the middle of the page. compass has been taken. The length of 7 cm is copied with the compass. And the size was deducted from that large line segment. Its two endpoints are named B and C. Then, a circle arc of radius 6 cm is drawn from point B. At the end, a circle arc of radius of 5 cm is taken from the point C. These two circle arcs meet each other at point A. The scale and pencil reintroduced to connect points B to A first. And then points C and A also join through a line as well. So far, we have drawn the given triangle. Now, the similar triangle to this given triangle will be drawn. For this, we have to draw a straight line segment of arbitrary size from point B at an approximately 45 degree angle. After that, start cutting off the line segment into 7 equal parts. Since the arms of the required triangle are 7 by 5 times larger, and between 7 and 5, the bigger one is the 7. In any other question, if the ratio is different, the bigger between the numerator and the denominator is to be taken as the number of cuts to make. The equal line segments are named as BB1, B1, B2, B2, B3, B3, B4, B4, B5, B5, B6, B6, B7, etc. What is the value of the denominator here? It is 5, isn't? That's it. For this very reason, point C should be connected to B5. Then the angle CB5B that is generated at point B5 is to be copied at point B7. To do it, a circle should be cut between the two arms by placing the compass tip at the point B5. A circle arc of the same size is to be drawn from the point B7. Then take the radial distance between two points of intersection on the arms and draw a circle section from point there. The other arm of the constructed angle is drawn with a scale and a pencil. The other arm intersects the extended arm of PC at the point C dash. Now make an angle at point C dash which is similar and equal to that at point C. 
it is to be drawn just like before. Let's the other arm of this angle intersects the extension of the arm BA at point A dash. So the triangle A dash B C dash is a similar triangle to the given triangle A B C. Take a look at the relative size of the triangles together. If you like the video, give it a like. To find the channel easily in the subsequent time, subscribe to the channel now. Thanks for watching the video till the end.